Hello, we're going to do a maths cast now on simplifying algebra. So this is the very most basics of algebra and what you'll need to begin. So, if we look at a question, we are asked to simplify 3a add 2a. So all we have to do here is if we have three a's and then we add on two more a's, so we had three and now we've got two more, then we would have five a's. So over here, it works the same if we take away. If we have five ends, and we take away two of the ends, so if we have five of them, and we take away two of them, then we're left with three ends. So that's the most basic stage of it. That's what we need to learn first, how to add up or take away letters. Here, here's one which is a little bit different. 5y add y. So there's not a number in front of the y. Well, when there's not a number in front of this y here, it means 1y. So I can put a 1 there if I like to help us answer it. So now we know from what we learned a moment ago, 5y add 1y. Well, 5 and 1 is 6y's. Same with takeaways. 3c take away 1c. So the c on its own, of course, means 1c. So I can put a 1 there to help me. So 3 of the C's, take away one of the C's will give me two C's. Three take away one is two. Right, so now we know what to do with when the letter doesn't have a number in front. I think we can answer questions a little bit harder with more than one letter. So here we go. 4E, add 3F, add 2E, add 5F. So what we have to do here is we have to um, look at one letter at a time. So we look at the 4e here, and we also have a plus 2e. So remembering the plus in front of the 2e. Well, then that means we have 4e's, add 2e's, well, that will give us 6e's. Then you look at the f's afterwards. So here we have 3f's, remembering the plus in front of the 3f. And here we have a plus 5f. Uh, remembering the plus in front of the 5. Um, so when we have 3Fs and add on 5Fs, we know the 3 and the 5 will give us 8, so it's 8Fs. So it's 6E add 8F, which is our answer. We can't simplify any more than that. Right, next question's got one with a takeaway in. So it's 5W add 3G add 2W minus G. So just before we start, this G at the end hasn't got a number in front, so we know it means 1G. So take the letters separately. We're going to do the W's first. So we have five W's, and here we have a plus 2W. So remembering to put the plus in front of the 2 as well. So five W's and two W's added together will give us seven W's. Now we do our G's. So we have plus 3g there, take away 1g here. So 3g's, take away 1g, will give me 2g's. So it's 7w plus 2g. So there's the answer. Again, we can't simplify it anymore. So we've gone through the most basics of simplifying algebra. Have a go at these eight questions and see how you get on. Good luck.